Hmm, what's this? Hello, welcome back to The Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I continue with my Let's Play of Hom 7, The Lost Tales of Axioth, Every Dog Has His Day campaign, episode 11. Alright, in the previous episode, we roamed around, we did some stuff. What is that? Goose Trad. Necromancy additionally raises up to 40 banshees from 8% of the health of fallen living, living creatures after victorious combat. Huh, cool. Anyhow, um, yeah, we were doing stuff and junk and things, and it was fun and whatnot. No, we were uh, murdering some stuff, we plundered this, and we were about to uh, break off the turn and start the new one in the last episode. We're a little bit concerned with the guys pitter-pattering above us and uh, delving into our uh, area on occasion. Not a massively huge fan of that happening, but it does happen from time to time. And yes, like I said, not a massive fan of how that all went down, but again, we're okay. We can leave now. I'm going to try to snag up some of that and get out of here before more a bad Juju Magumbo comes down our line here. Um, School of War, not possible to rank him up any. I thought we just didn't have the money. Hmm. Well... Alright, well, we're going to snag up the ore now. We're getting a little, little bit closer here. I was trying to get a little bit further away view, but eh, we'll get a bit closer. Some uh, cash coming our way. That's pretty good. And uh, we don't really need mana. Snag up this. We will visit this, which will give us one to spirit. And it looks like all of these fights are going to be a little bit more challenging than the ones previous. Uh, I don't necessarily need that either. I can make it to that. Uh, there's certain ones that I can just avoid. I'd rather go up and take care of that first if I can. I think I'm going to attempt it. We'll see. Alright, we're up against three different types of elementals and some uh, vampire lords. We should be strong enough to deal with it. I don't know. We'll find out here soon enough, I suppose. Let us begin combat and see. Only time. Will tell. Alright, let's see. What are we going to do from here? I don't know exactly. We'll figure it out. Alright, we have quite the distance to cover before we really should be concerned in any way, shape, or form. Gonna move here. Would like to get ahead of the curve a little bit if we can. I'm gonna move here. I'm afraid that. Oh, well, no, nope, they're not gonna get hit yet. How much damage can I do? I can guarantee a single kill there, or I can do a little bit more. I think we need to take them out because I don't know how much damage they're gonna actually inflict. And with a little bit of high morale and high luck, we might. Nope, it's coming. Oh! Not on the one I was expecting. Okay, that's actually really good for us then. Okay, well, let's take a smack upside your head and almost annihilate you entirely. And we'll move here. Now the big rock man should come forward, and it looks like we have the edge ever so slightly. Pretty sure I can move here, and he's going to take the brunt of the hate. So I'm not too concerned, but if I'm wrong, well, then we're going to suffer for it. Nope, we're, we're solid. Alright, we're looking good. Okay, what I want to do is come over here and hit you nice and hard lack. And down you go. I'm going to come over here and actually end you. Which is going to be fantastic. And then we can, I guess, start to lay into both of you because we're good like that. Let the fire rain from the sky and annihilate your souls. It's fine. Alright, we're going to take another big nasty blast here. Alright. I don't know that I want to do that necessarily. So we'll do this instead. And I can back away with him. 
And I can hit you with this gal, the wonderful harpy that is. And I shall. It's not going to do a lot. I mean, we only have ten harpies. It's a little disappointing. But, in fact, you know, we really should get rid of harpies if we can all together because they're kind of detrimental to us. The more different units from different groups you have, or units from different groups you have, uh, the lower your morale is. But we do seem to have relatively high morale most of the time. But we have groups from the Stronghold or the Orcs or Barbarians, whatever you want to call them, the Hell or Inferno, and the Undead. So we have three things hitting against our morale. It's not that big of an issue right now, but it could become one eventually. Alright, we're going to go over here and take these on. I'm going to get a few more Lilum because we've been wanting them. Really, I have to hit recruit this way? That's super disappointing. What what is what's what's happening right now? Is there some problem here that I'm unaware of? Is it because I don't technically own this place? Well, it worked that time. All right, well, whatever. I don't know what to tell you guys. I have no idea. I thought maybe it's because I didn't own the place. I don't belong to an enemy, but it's whatever. We get, we got it back. It's fine. All right, going to come down here. I may actually go and fight those guys. I think I will, and we'll see what happens with that. All right, let's end the turn. Let's hope nothing comes down to attack and murder me and make me cry and weep. I think we're going to be okay, but yeah, you never know. All right, let's start combat. We know the air elementals are going to be able to potentially traverse the entire map. Make our lives somewhat miserable. And yes, it does appear that that's going to be the case, but we're going to be able to strike back without much of an issue. In fact, we're going to be able to take him out completely. No issue whatsoever. Alright, now we have the Shadow Stink guys coming forward. Again, I am not even relatively concerned with this. We are, however, going to advance ourselves a little bit more. And I suppose if I had to, I could come over here and do this. That seems a bit of a waste, but eh, whatevs. Whatevs. Take some uh, damage out of you. Do a little bit of annihilatory stuff here. That's right, that would be annihilating something. Okay, so at this point... We still have a few things left to do, like a rain death from the sky onto you. And I think potentially we can just end you. Maybe. Well, this is going to go a long way to doing just that. Not quite enough. Well, we'll take you out now. It's going to be fine. Alright, there you go. You are down and out. And we are going to ensure that we have this by that and the follow-up from the vamp and our flawless victory once again folks I know it's shiny it's impressive it's dog woggle all right so what is dog wogs doing now he's doggle woggle doodle all the Dane I guess uh, we can go with leadership it seems a little bit eh right now but I don't hate it I'm gonna go with defense though I think just keep increasing our strength, I suppose. Uh, I mean, we can get this. Don't really need it, but might as well snag it, I guess. We'll head on over here and take you guys out. Quick combat. Uh, always, always, always something that we have to continue to do. Alright. Bring it on. What's next? Alright, we have double griffins. A larger one and a smaller one. And then we have everything else. Alright, so let's advance ourselves. I am actually going to wait. I know. Shocking, painful, and unsatisfying all at the same time. Come here and attack. It's going to be okay. I am actually going to attack again. Alright, the doggies are going to come forward. Oh, and they're actually going to attack straight up and... I thought they were going to actually get wrecked, but apparently that's not the case. Alright, well they are, but this puts us in an interesting slash odd slash terrifying slash bad position. 
you believe in all the slashes that were thrown out there. Alright, and I don't care so much about you because I don't really feel like you are that big of a threat to us. You, however, are quite a large threat. And unfortunately, it does not appear that we're going to have a way of stopping you from being ridiculously, horribly, awfully annoying to us. So I'm going to come here and try to eat a little bit of your damage without dying, and I did. Which is pretty good. I'm going to come over here. I'm curious, what kind of spells do we have right now? Not a whole lot that can be useful. Now, what is attention? Uh, plus two to attack and three to defense to friendly creatures. Creature retaliates the attack warfare unit also shoots. Well, that's not very useful for us right now. Alright, I guess we're going to go with engage. And we're going to go for a, hopefully a crit here. Nope. But, again, we're looking okay-ish. And he looks like he's just going to have to absorb a tremendous amount of damage. Oh, and the low morale is our friend, ladies and gentlemen. The low morale is our friend. Okay, well, we're going to come over here and take you out of the fight. We said good day, sir. Boom. All right, more negative morale going to you. We're going to try for maybe a crit times two. No crit. High morale enough. Nope. Okay, and a follow-up attack here. Hex of Disruption, and I guess that's that. And he once again skipped or forfeited his turn, I suppose. Well, we can throw out some hate here. What are you looking at? You're looking solid. There's no way that thing's going to kill you. All right, hop on over and do some damage. What are we looking at for Dog Woggle anyway? He's got 15 defense. I mean, it's mildly impressive how much defense he actually has. All right. Well, there we go. Complete. There we go, guys. There we go. It's, it's my pirate side coming out of in me. There we are. We're doing pretty good. Or there we go is what I think I was originally going to say. I'm not gonna plunder yet. Maybe if I can plunder from this angle? No, nope, it's from the other angle. Alright, well, we'll take on that. We'll maybe get some skeletons out of here or some juggernauts. I don't know what I want to get from there. Maybe nothing. Maybe we'll just go up and take that on. I have no idea. Alright, let's go over here to good old Sandro and snag up a little bit more stuff here. And then I suppose... Suppose we can attempt to go back down this way and grab some additional stuff. And I believe the good old dog wogs himself. Oh no, he learned spells. That's what it was. Spells. Uh, you. Yay. Yeah, I know. I know he knew. I know he learned new spells. I am aware of this. All right, let's end the turn. And let's hope that we're looking okay. All right, that looks like we're okay-ish for now. Come over here and snag up some more gold, because we... I don't know if I'd say desperately need it, but we need it fairly bad. And we are going to finally take a city back. And it is going to be quick combat, and it is going to be ours, and it is going to be glorious. And now we actually have a real city where we can actually build up. We've learned new spells again, which I don't care about. And I am happy that we finally can do something useful. It is good. Alright, what do we want to build first? What is going to be our biggest contributor? It's going to be the Sepulcher. And to upgrade that, we have enough to do it. So I'm looking forward to that as well. And we need to upgrade this as well to get some more gold coming our way. And the first of our problems has been solved, ladies and gentlemen. The first of our problems has been solved. What do we have available right now to pick up some uh, of the liches, which I think I will keep here for right now. I shall come over here, and I don't believe there is a way to get to this horrible place other than from behind. So, we managed to block off this area and keep it under wraps. We'll be okay. 
it's it's gonna be interesting, but I think we've got something going our way for once. Alright, gonna snag that up. Snag this up. And I'm gonna snag that up, potentially. And that gives us quite a bit of gold to play with, and hopefully it's going to be enough to get us what we need. And hopefully we don't run into a week of the plague, because that would be awful. Alright, so nothing going on there. Apparently everybody is now freaked out that we have done what we've done. And I gotta say, I'm a pretty big fan of that. I do like freaking out the enemy. It makes me super happy. Alright, I shall come over here and slay you and then reclaim whatever was lost. Or whatever is neutral right now. Quick combat sees us with no loss. Nope. Lay it manually. The good news is we will get another level up. The bad news is... Nah, there's not really any bad news. That's that's literally it. It's just we'll get another level up. Alright, let's begin. We shall advance ourselves a little bit faster than initially planned. We shall move here, and I believe he's going to move to be annoying. That is my heartfelt belief. We'll see. Uh, he's going to probably charge across, hit our giant uh, doom and gloom guys here. Death is... Nope. Okay, well, that didn't really work for him either, so... Take from that what you will. We will move into position to soak some damage, though. And with our Lilum, we'll be able to do a little bit more uh, damage. That should put us in a relatively good spot. Uh, 76. I think we're going to be okay. About the sea. I know he's not going to be able to counterattack again. He's still looking like he's going to be okay. Alright, doing less damage than I thought we would against this group. Alright, I'm going to move a bit closer. Will we survive it? We did. Alright, so we're fine. We're 100% solid. No big deal. Alright. I should be more than powerful enough to deal some damage to this guy, so I'm going to attempt it. With the high luck, that does kind of cement my ability to not get owned, and it also prevented him from being able to attack at all, which is a net win for us. Medium hit there... And another one coming. Again, small potatoes, but eh, potatoes nonetheless. Alright, our big man gets to come over here and end you. We said good day, sir. More than likely. Nope, not quite. Close. Alright. Well, let's see. What will we do if we hit you with that? Not quite enough, but close. Still, it's going to cripple them. And if we get a high morale roll... Nope. Alright, and the onslaught onto our little guy here. It's not going to really matter. Because victory, once again, is ours with absolutely no losses. Alright, we leveled up once again as well. Dogwog, what are we doing for you, buddy? Don't care about that. Health for creatures. If a friendly creature did not attack. Eh. We'll get some more health. That should be useful, especially for the uh, larger stacks that we have. Don't necessarily need this. I am going to tag it, though. Then we're going to start backing up. Alright, we're going to go back to Mortis, though. And here at Mortis, we are going to... Bring forth the Vampire Mausoleum as well. And the reason I'm doing this is I want to have access to these troops as often as we can. Oh good, we can pull the skeletons in from here. That's nice. In fact, we can pull everything in from here. Coils Keep. I mean, we got a lot of stuff that we can pull. Yeah, right, we're, out of, we're out of oomph, though. And then Haven Fort, we can pull the Grim Riders. Alright, that's cool. Alright, we will end our turn. Oh, for a minute there, I'm like, oh god, where did that come from? It's going to kill me, but it's okay. Alright. Week of the Owl. A week when owls are not what they seem. Are owls really ever what they seem? Let's be honest. I don't think so. I think you guys don't think so either. 
Okay, we're gonna tag this up. We are gonna flip on over here. We're going to take this over. Once again, grabbing the Lilum that actually went into the right spots this time. I don't know why particularly, but I'm okay with that. And we've already claimed all of these things. And now we're gonna come down here and we're gonna take over our already plundered thing, I guess. It's gonna be the play. Meanwhile, Rigor Mortis is gonna come over here and do nothing because we have no money. However, we can trade some of the resources that we have for a little bit of gold. Do that. Is that enough to get me this? No, I need 5,000. Alright, well, that's fine. Alright, we'll end the turn, and we may be able to cut that off or catch it on the way through. Not sure. Either way, we'll see soon enough, I suppose. Well, I suppose we will. Alright, it looks like you are probably going to be safe. Maybe. Potentially. Alright, well, let's de-plunder this. Or at least claim it. I could once again go for that fight. And you know what? I may actually do so. I think I will. I think I will go for that fight. And there's a reason for it. I'm not going to field everybody that we have, that way I don't have to risk losing a lot of people, so should be okay. Alright, let's end the turn. No, let's not end the turn. We have a city again, see? I, I almost skipped the, the point where I can actually get some more money out of this. Anyway, well, we spent money, but we'll be making more soon enough. I think we're gonna be okay, guys. I think we will. Alright, well, we will not be meeting up with that, and I'm okay with that as well. Alright, so we're going to go here, we're going to do battle with you. I'm going to start the combat. I believe we we still got a little bit more that we can do before we uh, have to break off the episode. Um, huh, i got to think what the best play is going to be. If I move there... And I move there, and I move here... Here, that should be okay, right? I should be safe. I don't need to field you, so I'll just put you back in. Alright, we'll try this out. I know the big man can leap on us, and I'm a little concerned with that, but not horribly concerned just yet, so... I think what I'm going to do is actually defend. I should have waited on that. I'm going to wait on you. Going to try to do a bit of damage to you. Oh, good, we got the high luck. Exactly what I was hoping for. Did we get the high morale too? Nope. Alright, leap on. Oh, nope, he's not leaping. Okay. Not attack this target. That was interesting. Alright, what is he gonna do? He defended. Okay, was not expecting that. That was an unexpected uh, dealie there. Alright, not super concerned with it. We're going to engage now, and pretty much everything is done. Like, I don't foresee any possible way. Come on, high. Oh, let's hope we had high enough luck there for that. Alright, we're going to try anyway. Oh, good. There we go. The high luck still not enough to take him down. I'm kind of surprised. Alright, well, we'll continue at it with our little harpies that continue to be annoying to all our enemies. And we did it without a loss. Yay, the leaping guy did not leap. That's pretty good. Sweet. So no losses there. I mean, we can stop here if we needed to, but there's no point. I'll check. Yeah, there's, there's no point. Alright, we shall continue down this way. And we are going to meet up with our compatriot here soon enough. Going to trade for some money here. We need to do a little bit of money trading. A little. We don't need to do a lot, but some for sure. Alright, that's going to be a little bit better. And then we're going to meet up with them over there. We'll swap over our troops, and then we will come back and well, good things will happen to us, I believe. We need the 10,000 for that. How much is this? 3,500. 6,000. Um, is there anything that's not going to be horrible for us? Is there a sacrifice? Hmm... 
Uh, all these are too expensive. Alright, we're going to let it go this particular turn. We'll see. The next turn should give us the money for the capital. And then we'll be okay. We'll be okay finally, folks. Alright, good. We're, we have the money for the capital. Alright, so we built that up, and we still have enough time to hopefully get the money to get these things up and running as well. It's going to make me super happy. Alright, I'm going to move here. Going to trade with you, good sir. Give you a few more of... You know, I can give you all of these guys. I'll just take the ghosts back here. And that's that, I suppose. Have you come on up the path here and do what you do. Snagging up everything along the way. And what can we do, or what should we do at this point? Um, well, we need to get over here and tag this in a minute. Let's tag this first. Can we make it there now? It looks like we can! Oh, he already has stables applied. Really? When did that happen? I don't know, but apparently he did. Okay, well, we're going to go and start claiming up some of the junk over here next. And it should pretty much enable us to do whatever we want to do at that point. So, I'm looking forward to it. You all should be as well. We're going to end the turn. Then we've got two to three more, t well, probably one or two more turns left, if I'm being honest here. One or two more turns left before we break it all off and we put it to bed for this particular day, but that doesn't mean we can't accomplish a little bit more stuff before it all comes crashing down. It's not going to come crashing down, I'm just saying that, because I felt like it. Alright, so we're going to head on over there and start murdering some stuff on that side. And we're going to go back to Mortis here, and what are we going to grab? We're going to grab up this. Actually, we're... are we? Uh, we are going to grab up this for now. We're going to have to trade some more resources, it looks like. So, that being said, we have none. We need stone sort of desperately. So, for the desperate stone need, I do eight there. Do four, eight there. We'll see where that puts us on the next turn. I don't know how much do we get. We get two per day. Alright, so we're going to be okay. Alright, we end the turn. And we're about to get into another battle and hopefully be victorious. A little bit of a nastier fight, but again, I'm not super concerned with it. I think we're going to be fine. Alright, start the combat. I believe once we clear out whatever we're doing over here, we will break off the episode. Alright, so he's going to get the first move. I don't know why particularly, but he's not going to get the first move next time around, so there's that. Alright, we can go over here behind you and attack and do very small amounts of damage, but still, it's going to be mildly inconvenient for you, so meh. And then we're going to come over behind you again and do much larger. You can't be flanked, right? No. Alright, we'll just go from the bottom here. That should keep us out of range of him, or at least lower his range. Fatal Strike. Eh, it, it did damage. It did work. I'm okay with that. Alright, high luck, no high luck, it's okay. But high morale lets us see it fly once again. And he's going to move on over. He is going to still attack. Ooh, it actually did a pretty sizable chunk of damage too. Mildly impressive. And with the high luck, I think he's dead. He Alright, so down he goes. Not going to take that fight on may actually do this one. I should have done my uh, thing first, but it doesn't matter because we got high level. Alright, sweet destiny is ours. Another level up, as I'm sure you all expected. Learn that. And yeah, let's take a look real quick. Alright, we are looking really good right now, guys and gals. Let me tell you, we are looking uh, solid. The underground is ours to command here. Like, we really can't move there? Like, that's a thing, huh? I feel like that's a broken... Like, seriously? We can't... Yeah, apparently we can't. Okay. Well, I guess we'll head on over there to deal with you in a moment's time. Finish moving you into your, wait, 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 your position. Nice and slow and steady-like. Come on. 
Tag that up, come over here. Nice and casual like. Very good. Gaining some spells and doing stuff. Nice. Move on up there. We'll go to Mortis. We will do the vamp upgrade here. Well, gathering more vamps. It's not really an upgrade per se, but you, you get the idea. Alright, and we will finally upgrade the skellies there because of reasons. And I'm going to say that that is going to do it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, well, stick around. There will be more to come, uh, probably a bit more frequently now that I am uh, done with a couple of extra games that were laying around doing stuff. The Banner Saga 2, while it's done, I'm still going to play through the survival mode of the game, but I'm going to do it much slower. It's not going to be a priority. Maybe one or two episodes a week. Um, on top of that, I finished up... Oh, I'm totally drawing a blank. Oh, the Battle Brothers season is over. I have one or two more videos I'm going to actually do of that, but it's just to show off the new interface and such. So, that being said, I have more time. Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. I'll see you next time with more. Hom7, um, The Lost Tales of Axioth, Every Dog Has His Day campaign. Until then, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later.